I'm Samantha Deitcher for Investment Pitch Media. Great Atlantic Resources has acquired, through staking, the Southwest Golden Promise property, located in central Newfoundland. The 1,000 hectare property, centered approximately 4 kilometers west of the southernmost region of the company's Golden Promise property, covers gold soil anomalies up to 7.6 grams per tonne and reported gold-bearing quartz float up to 6.7 grams per tonne. The primary target within the Southwest Golden Promise property is an approximately 260 meter long northeast southwest trending zone of historic gold soil anomalies. Multiple 2008 soil samples within this trend are reported to have returned anomalous values for gold, including eight samples in the 36 to 82 parts per billion gold range. Panned soil samples at two of three sites within this anomalous zone were reported to yield gold flakes. The Golden Promise property remains the company's focus in the central Newfoundland gold belt. The Golden Promise property hosts multiple gold-bearing quartz veins, the most advanced being the Jacklin Main Zone, for which the company recently announced a mineral resource estimate. Using a weighted average cutoff of 1.1 grams per tonne resulted in a total inferred resource of 106,000 ounces capped and 119,900 ounces uncapped. All resources were classified as inferred because of the relatively wide spacing of drill holes through most of the zone. Generic mining costs of $2.50 US a tonne and processing costs of $25 US a tonne were used together with a gold price of $1,300 US currency per ounce. A gold-bearing vein, referred to as Linda Snow White vein, occurs in the southwest region of the Golden Promise property, where reported historic surface samples included gram samples of 105 and 232 grams per tonne gold and a channel sample of 29.7 grams per tonne gold over 0.5 meters. The best reported historic drill hole intersection from 2006 at the Linda Snow White vein was 19.5 grams per tonne gold over a 1.15 meter core length. Similar to the company's Golden Promise property, the Southwest Golden Promise property is located within the exploit subzone of the Newfoundland Dunnage Zone. Within the exploit subzone, both properties lie along the north-northwestern fringe of the Victoria Lake Supergroup, a volcano sedimentary terrain. The northwestern margin of both properties occurs proximal to, and in part contiguous, with a major collisional boundary and suture zone, known as the Red Indian Line, which forms the western boundary of the exploits subzone. Recent significant gold discoveries in this region of the exploit subzone include those of Sokomen Iron Core and Marathon Gold Core. The property is located approximately 40 kilometers west southwest of the Moosehead project of Skokomen Iron Core. Skokomen reported a drill intersection of 45 grams per tonne gold over an 11.9 meter core length, including a 1.35 meter core length quartz vein intersection of 386 grams per tonne gold from a discovery made during their 2018 diamond drill program. The Valentine Lake Gold Camp of Marathon Gold Core is located approximately 55 kilometers to the southwest. As reported on Marathon's website, the Valentine Lake Gold Camp currently hosts four near-surface, mainly pit shell constrained deposits, with measured and indicated resources totaling 2.7 million ounces of gold at 1.85 grams per tonne, and inferred resources totaling 1.5 million ounces of gold at 1.77 grams per tonne. Great Atlantic cautions that mineralization at the Moosehead property and Valentine Lake Gold Camp is not necessarily indicative of mineralization on the Golden Promise property. The shares are trading at 5 cents. For more information, please visit the company's website, greatatlanticresources.com, contact Christopher Anderson, President and CEO, at 604-488-3900, or email office at greatatlanticresources.com. Investor Relations is handled by Kaywin Consulting, Inc. They can be reached at either 604-558-2630 or 888-280-8128 or by email at info at I'm Samantha Deitcher for Investment Pitch Media.